Hey guys, so today I'm just going to update you on some Magic Pro news from Lewis Scott Vargas and from, of course, Eric Froelich or Efro. Anytime I tweet anything about black, hashtag Black Life Lives Matter or equality, I lose a ton of followers and get a block, get to block a bunch of others. And it's honestly my favorite feature of this website. Of course, he is talking about Twitter. Now, he commented one more time about a Superman analogy that I will edit in here. But my point is, uh, it's very highly politically charged. We live in a crazy environment. There is rioting. I live in Houston. Houston is where his uh, George Floyd's two daughters reside. And George Floyd is from Houston. So his family's from Houston, and there has been a lot of writing. They arrested 200, 300 people yesterday and some new higher number today. And this is the quote I find a little bit offensive. Maybe the reason why you don't see the police shutting down the white supremacy rallies is the same reason you don't see Clark, Clark Kent and Superman in the same place. Again, he's saying that the police are not shutting down the white supremacy rallies because they are attending said white supremacy rallies, which I think is a very offensive take. Now, the police is not your friend in most cases. Uh, They're normally called upon when there is a trouble situation and they're looking to punish and or arrest somebody at that point in time. However, you know, the police, I don't think on a whole are racist. Um, I think you have a few bad apples. And yeah, I do think the police should. um, I mean, you kind of already know who. if you work at the police force, you know who those bad apples are. The same with uh, LSV. Been loving the stream in a world full of scams. It's the real deal. He has been accused of promoting what many consider a scam, the mythic market. That's where you buy a share in a black note Lotus, for instance, for $90,000. You buy a share for $30 or whatever it is. And there is no way to liquidate the share. There is no way to get your money back. It's just kind of gone. If you buy five shares, you get a pin. If you buy... I think 20 shares, you get a binder to put your certificate into. And this is pretty funny. Been loving the stream in a world full of scams. And this is what people said. Uh, Lost all respect for this, for him. This is disgusting. Outright scam set up here, people. And he hasn't even responded to any of the comments. And this is what it is. They... Pro Magic players think that they are political experts. They think they are. It's really interesting. I'm not saying that it's not possible for Eric Froelich to have experienced racism, but not on the level an African-American, an Asian-American, a minority, a Hispanic-American would experience in the U.S. Just like uh, as soon as things get called out for what they are, there's no response from Channel Fireball. There's no response from LSV. And yeah, it, this is pretty a pretty bad look for both of them. Um, Eric Froelich and LSV, two of the biggest names and two of the most vocal names in Magic the Gathering, both recently, you know, here. But why do you think it is a scam? They are just running off of your money. You are only getting paid if the product you invest in sells and they are in complete control of that and you are under no obligation to act. They are under no obligation to actually do that. The other, only other way you could theoretically make money is if you sell, sell your shares to another sucker because, but you can't do that yet and may never ever be able to do that. And they control how much it sells for. This is a great way to sell collectibles for match prices and make fees on either side. And that's what I think the point is. It's like a timeshare. Watch Dave Ramsey's piece. Um, It's a really recent piece um, on timeshares and why they're bad. 
this is bad for almost the exact same reason. Hi guys.